All right, so now we're going to move on to Newton's second law and Newton's second, or the second station, okay? So this is going to be FR activity one. I have a ramp here, and it's on a book, so it's got a slight angle. I have an empty cup right here, and that's going to push the cup, all right? So I have a little ball. This is called a ball bearing, all right? So this I'm going to let go, and we're going to see how far it pushes the cup. Now, we're going to keep the mass the same no matter what. And remember, when we hold mass the same and increase our force or acceleration, the other one's going to increase, right? So let's see how far the cup moves. So here's the first one. It barely moved the cup, right? So now I'm going to increase my acceleration. I'm going to change how high my ramp is, and we're going to see how much it moves. Notice how that pushed the cup even more. So now we're going to increase our acceleration even more. All right, so now I have a really tall ramp and a, and a cup right here. All right. Notice how that pushed the cup much more. So whenever I hold mass the same and increase my acceleration, that's when I'm going to see, oops, that's when I'm going to see a larger force. Okay, so that's in the second law. So here you're going to be answering these two questions with what we just did. Now for this part right here, for activity two, what you're going to have to do is you're gonna to have to imagine how pushing a chair with more books on it is going to affect the amount of force that we have to use. And that's what you're gonna answer right here. So that's your Newton's second law station.